It was one of his key promises when he took the job as head of the Metropolitan Police to introduce total policing. What Commissioner Bernard Hogan Howe means by that is to concentrate thousands of officers across London onto one specific problem on one specific day. Today the target was drive without insurance. Matt Cook reports. An unlikely showroom. All of the vehicles here have been seized, some have been crushed and all of them were uninsured, including this £150,000 Jeep. Yes. Today sees the first visible signs of total policing, the Commissioner's new strategy to tackle specific offences with a day of action. This morning it was uninsured drivers. Here in Camberwell, police officers are pulling over flagged vehicles. They're searching the cars and asking drivers for their paperwork. Now, in operations like this one, last year, the Met seized 34,000 cars. They ended up crushing 11,000 of them. If we see a Range Rover with four 19-year-old lads on board, that is an odd situation. And because it's out of the normal, uh, our officers are likely to pull that vehicle across. Remember that this is an operation that is designed to target and disrupt criminality. Not all were happy with the disruption, but fully covered drivers were allowed to leave quickly. I think it's a good thing. If you're legal, you're unable to be on the street. You shouldn't be bothered about being pulled over and stopped and asked certain questions. It's fine with me. There's still around 250,000 uninsured cars in London. There may be a mountain to climb, but the commissioner says tackling this problem will lead to a reduction in overall crime too. It worked in his old patch of Merseyside. Uninsured vehicles and vehicles that are untaxed, 70% of those vehicles are owned by people who've got a criminal record. So we're taking vehicles from criminals. And what that enables us to do is to reduce their mobility. We know that vehicles that are uninsured are about five times more likely to have an accident uh, and are uninsured. So it's a great opportunity to not only re reduce criminality, but also to keep the roads safe. Back on the roadside, police have seized more than 300 cars in just one day and they've made arrests for drugs, theft and immigration offences. Next, the Commissioner promises to focus efforts on drug dealers and gangs in another test of his new strategy. Matt Cook, BBC London News. St Paul's Cathedral.